site like this. The project will create more than 1,000 jobs. Birthdays are billed as our special day. For one little girl, you have no idea just how special it is. Two years ago, Eddie Meyer met the Katergian family, who feared their little Ellie wouldn't see her first birthday because of a huge tumour in her chest. Yay! Turning four is one of those milestones we often take for granted, not in this family. Sometimes I just... I want to cry thinking that she's gotten to this stage. We first met Ellie Katergian and her family two years ago, just a year after doctors found a tumour the size of a rock melon in her chest, so large it was pushing her heart and lungs to one side. They basically told us by day two, she, you might lose her tonight. Ellie's tumour was aggressive and resistant to chemotherapy. What saved her? The Zero Childhood Cancer Program, which precisely identified the exact genetic makeup of her cancer and tested it against proven and experimental treatments from around the world. It hit the jackpot, a new drug from the US. She has had the magic drug uh, for uh, now three and a half years, um, which brought about an amazing shrinkage of this lump in her chest that she first came to us with. The Zero Childhood Cancer Program uses a highly personalised treatment for each child and their particular cancer. More often we are able to identify potential treatments that would otherwise not be available to these children. Each year in Australia 1,000 children are diagnosed with cancer, around 20 a week, and sadly each week three of those children will die. The Zero Childhood Cancer Program has enrolled 365 kids with the most aggressive cancers. It wants to lift that to 400 from around the country. Treating children where there's less than 30% chance of survival, Zero has offered potential treatments in 70% of those cases. At the start of Childhood Cancer Awareness Month, it's seeking donations to bring Ellie's joy to other families. Every birthday is just a bonus. Just seeing her grow her own little personality, her own little humour. We're just blessed. Where once there were tears and fears about the future, now it's nothing but smiles. <laughs> Eddie Meyer, Nine News. Happy birthday, beautiful Ellie. Well, a new style of puffer has been launched to help asthma sufferers better manage their condition and it's been added to the...